What is up everybody, Monster Jam Fanatic here, back again with my third ever Spin Master unboxing. So far, I have unboxed four trucks, and that is the new Spin Master Dragon, Purple, Jester, Blue Thunder, and Storm Damage. Those are all from the two packs, and today I am unboxing Grave Digger with the Chrome Wheels and Wildflower. Before I open these, tell me which one out of these two look better and which one was made better. So we have Wildflower and Grave Digger. So let's get these open right now, guys. So we're going to take a look at Grave Digger first. We'll save Wildflower for second, definitely. So here is Grave Digger. It has the realistic, very shiny black. kind of looks like a dark chromish wheels. It looks really nice. It has the silver bead locks and all that. It looks really good. I like those wheels. I think they did it better, way better than Metal on the wheels right there. I give it a 10 out of 10 on the wheels. Here's the underside. The roll cage is slimmer and longer, like I explained in my first um, unboxing video, which is pretty interesting. Here is Grave Digger right here. Everyone knows what Grave Digger looks like. It has the goblin right here, the haunted house with the tree and everything. You know. But here is the top of Grave Digger right here. Just showing you the molding difference. I know you may have already seen it in other people's videos. I'm pretty sure I'm not the first channel you've seen these on. But if you have, then here is what the truck looks like from a distance. You see the molding in general looks pretty good. You can see the roll cage through. And, and you can even see a little guy in there. There's even a guy in the driver's seat for Spin Master, which Mattel never did. That's okay. It looks like the hood is like wider. It's like wider. It, I don't know. It's more bold. It looks okay. It looks cool. Uh, I don't know what to compare to like in real life. I don't know if this is more realistic to real life Grave Digger or not. I mean, it's up to you. I guess it's opinionated. I don't really know. That can be up to you guys watching. But here is Grave Digger. And now, where did I do? Oh, yeah. Here's Wildflower. Oh, my gosh. This thing is so cool. I, I never thought I'd, I'd have a Wildflower die cast unless I like bought a custom of it off eBay, which I, I doubted I'd ever do. But here is Wildflower, so let's get on the side here. It says Wildflower with the rose beside it and the Monster Jam symbol above it with the pink top, which in real life, it's like a cloth hanging off the top. It's pretty cool. Here is the grill. It's not painted, but you know what? It's still something. But let's take a look at the bottom here. It's like a rose gold roll cage, which is the first color roll cage I've unboxed so far. The other ones are just silver. That is pretty interesting. I'm not saying cool. It's interesting. I don't, I don't know. I mean, it's not too big of a deal. Like, you can kind of see it's more of a pinkish, like rose gold from a distance too. But I don't think it's too big of a deal. It looks pretty girly. It is still pretty cool. The purple chassis and the pink wheels with the BKT tires. So, there you guys have it. Grave Digger and Wildflower. I think these two were perfect to be in the doubles. Tell me what you guys think about these two. I am very excited. I still have a lot more Spin Master trucks. These are all made the same night because I got a huge haul tonight. So, that's that. And I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, and then leave a comment if you have any questions or if you just want to say something. So, thanks for watching and peace out.